I'll just be like, sorry, babe. Um, that's a baby. Hey guys, thanks for joining me today. This is Jenny from Awake Mama. And today I bring you all about my experience in my weeks one through four during my pregnancy. So, uh, you know what? Let me stop talking, just stay watching. Okay, so the symptoms for my first week all the way through my fourth week varied, but they pretty much stayed the same. Now, I'm not gonna be focusing too much on the first and second week because it's really that long two week wait. I did do a two week wait video, which you could go ahead and feel free to check it out. I'm gonna put the link right over here. You could watch it before or after you watch this video, but definitely stay with me right now because I am about to tell you all about my symptoms and what I felt during my third and fourth week of pregnancy. Now I have all the symptoms written down on my period tracker app. During the third and fourth week, I started feeling twinges in my nipples and around my lower stomach area. So I started feeling twinges, sharp pains, butterfly feelings and like just like fluttering feelings but it was on and off it was not every day i also had slight headaches on and off ever since like i got pregnant it was just like my number one thing it was just headaches and it was really weird for me because i don't usually get headaches it wasn't like something that i couldn't stand but it was just something that it was there and i was like why and i did feel super hungry that week the day that i got the positive pregnancy test i felt really hungry but I hadn't really eaten much that day, so I can't really say like, oh my God, I'm already feeling hungry because I have a baby inside of me because I know it was too early. I'm just telling you what I felt and what I wrote down. So I got the positive pregnancy test on Monday and then I got, I had nausea on Wednesday, which it was my third positive pregnancy test. We were going to the doctor that Wednesday. I told my boyfriend, I was like, hey, let me go to this gas station in the corner because we really don't have like anything here to eat and we woke up kind of late. I remember that when I was waiting for the lady to like give me the breakfast, I just started feeling like, it was funny because I had never ever in my life felt that before. Not even when I felt sick, when I felt like nothing. Like I just started feeling like really hot. Like I got like these hot flashes inside of me. And I remember I was like, oh my God, is this one like, pregnant women feel when you want to throw up and you're about to throw up and you have to throw up oh my god like what do I do so I started like looking around and I was like where's the bathroom like there has to be a restroom in this gas station right and I see and it's, it was like right on my right and I saw the door and I was like oh my god and I started feeling worse and worse and I, I started sweating oh my god it was horrible and this lady's like taking forever with the sandwich with the tostada and I'm like just sweating there like waiting and waiting and like I'm just starting to feel now like something weird in my stomach and I'm like oh my god don't throw up Jenny I have to check if the bathroom is open and I was like okay it's open so I kind of like left it kind of open because I was like I can't just throw up in the middle of like everyone here there was like a line waiting for like people just waiting for their food and I'm waiting for my food and I'm up next and this lady's taking forever and it's just two lattes and two tostadas and I'm like okay so I check the door I leave it in like a little open just in case I have to like run and right when I'm feeling all of that, I'm just sweating balls. The lady's like, here you go, miss. And I'm like, oh, thank you. I throw her her tip. I run outside. I happen to have like a, a paper bag in my car. And I remember I just grabbed that bag and I was like holding the wheel and I put the bag here. So I'm like, I drive off the gas station. And as I'm driving off, obviously I was like paying attention and going slow. But my, my reaction was to just throw up. I was on an empty stomach so nothing actually came out of my mouth now week four I remember I had nausea again and it was because I woke up and I'm like oh let me just be all healthy just decided to drink water with apple cider vinegar thinking okay this is like I'm gonna start doing this every morning for the baby and blah blah for a cleanse and of course I remember like my <laughs> my partner finished um, cooking breakfast and right when I have like breakfast on the plate and I'm like starving so I eat all the breakfast Right when I finished the whole breakfast, I just started feeling like exactly how I felt at the gas station. No way, I just ate. I need to keep that breakfast down. And like, I started like not freaking out, but I was like, okay, Jenny, breathe, relax. I'm like, this is not happening. You just had breakfast and the baby needs that breakfast and you need it. So you gotta keep it in there. And I took like a few big breaths and he brought me some water and it thankfully went away within like two minutes. I also had white lotiony tons of it CM 
since the first week that I got pregnant. I started feeling tired and fatigued and I just wanted to sleep. Like, I still want to sleep. That's the main symptom that I've had so far. I just feel exhausted. I feel like I've done so many things throughout the day and I've done nothing really. So it's definitely the pregnancy. As far as my breasts, they weren't really like a lot bigger, but they were fuller. They haven't hurt as much as other women say that it hurts for them. But I also had lots of gases and lots and lots and lots of bloating, okay? Oh my God, the gases and the bloating has been serious. And it's so not glamorous, but pregnancy, nobody told me that pregnancy is, is gonna be not glamorous at all. And my boyfriend would be like, and I'm, I, I'll just be like, sorry, babe, um, that's a baby. And he'll just look at me like, really Jenny, like this has never happened to you but hey it's part of the pregnancy what can I say I'm loving the pregnancy so far and just what else guys thank you so much for being with me today if you like this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and you already know subscribe subscribe for a lot more of these type of videos a lot more of other type of videos and just more Jenny from awake mama so thanks again for watching till next time stay tuned for more bye